Hello everybody, it's Johnny Fire Flame talking. Welcome back to the next Mad Little Pony Friendship is Magic reaction. Uh, I know I'm very, I am as always late, but now starts the quest, so to speak. Now uh, comes the time for me to work my way up to the finale, and I have a bunch of episodes to go. Um, but let's not daily dally any longer, because I want to get to it as soon as possible. So let us just jump right into it, uh, into our newest episode, which it will be Road to Friendship. Sure, there's a joke in there somewhere. Anyway, if you're ready, my dear friends, let us watch Road to Friendship, Mother Little Pony, Episode 8, se uh, Season 8, Episode 19. In 3, 2, 1, go. I don't know, folks. She's been in there a long time. <laughs> Helping Trixie oh. with the magic show. Oh, Flurry. Do you suppose the terrifying trunk escape is too much for her? What if the great and powerful Trixie can't escape? <gasps> but if you're there, I like that Twilight is there. Here. What is that? I wonder who that tall one is. Of course. <laughs> Crab apple surprise! You should out a tail pony before you go a pooping them around the stage. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. Trixie, that was an amazing show. Flurry Heart and I loved it. I am so glad we decided to come. You two Aww. have a real chemistry. The terrifying mm. chunk uh, The Phantom agrees. A great and powerful assistant. Aww. The way you two work together, it's like you've known each other as long as Twilight and I have. It was pretty fun. Of course it was. There's nothing better than a bond with another pony. You can share all kinds of things. Sunshine, sunshine. <laughs> <Lots of weight. laughs> wow, the return of this. Do a little shake. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll stick to the stage magic. Yeah, now. I think um, the they're, 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 they're good. They're good. good. I love these two. Honestly, though, they have great chemistry. I don't exactly mean the way that you all think, but you know what I mean. <laughs> And to you all share its magic with me. Big adventure comes up on a beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness is an easy feat, and magic makes it all complete. It's a Starlight and Trixie episode. I'm excited. I just say I love those two the, and like how they interact. So I'm excited to see how this one goes. Alright, let's see what's gonna happen. Much as I love my one pony show, it's always nice to come to Ponyville and perform with my great and powerful assistant. Cadence is right. We do work well together. Doing a show with you is almost as much fun as counseling students at Twilight School. Josh, <gasps> what are you supposed to be doing right now? See you later. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss Powerful. <laughs> Usually ponies Hello. call me Trixie. But Ms. Powerful has a nice ring. Yeah, it does. From here to Saddle Arabia, I have seen nothing that compares with your wondrous show. Would you consider blessing my homeland with it? Oh! I was just about to set out on tour. But Saddle Arabia is much farther than my usual route. <laughs> and uh, my caravan might not be suited for an extended tour. Mine is new and quite spacious. Oh my. If help persuade you, I would happily trade it for yours. Trade it? Heavens no! This is more than just some great and powerful wagon you see before you. It is shelter. It is transportation. It is my only friend on the long and lonely nights on the road. Very well. Then I must see as many of your performances as I can. If I cannot convince you to bring your tour to Saddle Arabia, I must be prepared to relate its magnificence to your many fans there. Many, many fans, fans, you say? <laughs> well, hmm. I suppose I don't know if this guy is trying to pull something. Wonderful! I look forward to seeing you on the road. And if you change your mind about the caravans, my offer remains open. Hmm. It's just so far away. Of course, <laughs> She's I love to start like that exciting she... places. I am a traveling magician, after all. Hmm, sounds like your mind's made up. Not quite. The road is a lonely place, and this oh. even more so. 
I was hoping I might convince my great and powerful assistant to come along. Wink, wink, really? wink, wink, wink. Of course. You're not just my assistant really? and my counselor. <laughs> You're also my friend. And what's better than a road trip with friends? Nothing. This will be the best magical road trip ever. Honestly, a road trip with friends is very enjoyable. Uh, oh. I should probably get some pony to cover mm. my stupid counseling duties while we're gone. Still don't trust that coast glow. Her, her cutie mark is a chest Trixie, piece. are you alright? And if One you guys know something about the finale, set. don't say anything. Oh, you brought luggage. No spoilers! <laughs> I mean, of course you brought luggage. You bet I did. Everything two ponies need for the road trip of their lives. Three 1,000 piece puzzles, one copy of Dragon Pit, the best board game in the history of ponies, my famous collection. I have some other spices, board games I love. And an inflatable raft. Why? Did I forget something? I can pop back to the castle and grab it. Oh no, it isn't that. Uh, what is it? Yeah, oh. Maybe we don't need the raft. <gasps> What's with we all just the balls? Needed a little great and powerful reorganization. Now everything fits just fine. Oh, who am I kidding? My wagon is too small for us. I understand if you're having second thoughts. Second thoughts? Are you kidding? This wagon isn't small. It's uh, cozy, and there's and no such kind of thing cramps, as too I would imagine cozy. with all the stuff inside. Well, all right then. I guess it's time to hit the road. Uh, I'll, I'll start us off. Oh, that's a smoke okay. bombs. Maybe there is such a thing as too cozy. So this episode is going to be about her, like, convincing herself sure to give away the wagon. I'm sure. And you're not backing Don't you have any, like... Two of us sleeping in that cozy I can't remember. Top tricky. for the box. Trixie, there's plenty of high-quality inns to stay out on the way. Don't worry about it. I'm not backing out of the greatest and most powerful road trip bonding experience two ponies Aww. could ever have. Well, when you put it like that, I'm actually kind of excited. Me too. Oh, I love this. This is cute. Like Twilight or the others, they probably sing a song about it. Hey, song! I haven't had that in a while. We're off on a road to friendship. Oh, I love it already. Our ride might be tiny and small. It's walking, though, eh, Trix? I am walking. <laughs> road trips are a great way. We've been told to get along. I love the kind I'm of swing to, to it. To Ah, Jesus! Our bond of friendship is stronger <laughs> than this tour's demands. My offer to trade caravan still stands. Wait, what did he say? Nothing. We're so tired. The raft proved useful after all. Around. I guess we're stuck together because we're friendship bound. Sure is Goofy movie you reference. You too, buddy. You too, buddy. All the fiery swamp from that we're episode. All. Nah, it's a good song. Each got the other to blame. Any trip can be exhausting if you make a fuss. But we get on so well that there's no way to ah, Jesus. us. We're off on the road to friendship. Yeah. And there's nowhere that we'd rather be. Is that our key? In summer, winter, spring, and fall, we're friends throughout the year. This is a fun we're song. Or like a buddy movie where the two protagonists can't get away from each other because they're wearing hookups. We're friendship <laughs> That's a movie to reference. <laughs> I can't remember the the title of the movie, but I know the one they're referencing. The marketplace, perfect. I've learned the hard way that life on the road. That was a fun song. I love that. Supplies. And we only have so many bits, so we'll have to spend them wisely. Some shawarma, I think. Mm, sorry about wasting bits on street food. Oh, it's fine. Falafel you have to be careful about that. I talk from Besides, I can talk from experience. Street food can be very tempting. Hay cakes and juice. 
Um, why don't we go there? Oh, no, no, no. I always buy my hay cakes here. Oh. So we're just going to wait in line for hours, and, uh, which is totally cool. <laughs> Waiting in line bonding, right? After our falafel... It all, it all sounded a bit we too perfect. To everything on my list, but we are definitely set for breakfast. And I'm sure we'll find out that waiting in that super long line was worth it. A few hiccups always happen. We'll be back on the road to friendship after a good night's sleep. Roll full. <gasps> uh, I'm sure we'll find something. Nope. Sorry. All full. Ah, the Glopas Festival. Some nebula is no doubt filled to the brim. Oh, travelers such as ourselves. I want to see the pillars caravan. again. Why haven't we seen see them more? <laughs> you said there'd be plenty Sorry. of places to stay. Don't even worry about it, you said. You might have thought to make a reservation. Um, I've been with you singing and standing in line. When would I have done that? I don't know, but I'm starting to think you aren't as great and powerful an assistant as I thought. Really? So you just brought this me is going to, to drive a wedge work? between them. No, of course not. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm okay. just frustrated. I was really looking forward to a relaxing night in a nice room. These I things will you. never be relaxing. But since there's literally no But yes, make reservations. In, I guess it's lucky we've got the wagon. Always remember. Sleeping in tight quarters bonding. Yay. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Something I can do to make things more comfortable for you? You could get rid of this junk. Yes. Well, before we throw away the magical. How long does that go? Me years to collect. We could try switching hammocks. Fine. That was a long ass thing. <laughs> ah. Starlight is a snorter. I did not see that coming. What? I'm sorry. Your snoring is a bit um loud. <laughs> yeah, I do that. I had my village convinced we were being attacked by bears every night. <laughs> wow. Oh, we probably need a better solution here. Oh wow, that. Ladies and gentlemen. And she talks in a second. Now that I can imagine. What if she? What if? What if she? What if she begins doing magic tricks in her sleep? Sleep well. Sure did. We're on the road to friendship. The last of the cakes. Oh yeah. Sorry. It's fine. I don't suppose there's, you know, more juice. <laughs> I suppose that Ponyville is too far away for Starlight to teleport. <laughs> what the heck is with this guy? Looking forward to the first show of your tour. Is he going to be following us for the whole time? I do not know. She's been in there a long time. Do you suppose the terrifying trunk escape is too much for a pony who drinks all the juice and talks nonstop in her sleep? What if the great and powerful tricks? Oh dear, now we have to go through sleep? this. Because her roommate snores like an Ursa major? But if you're there, who's in here? There's not much room in here. At least you don't have to sleep in it with another pony. Oh this dear. show is much better in Ponyville. Oh, would you like the last carrot? I know how fond you are of eating the last of things. Oh no, it might make me thirsty. Ah, oh, the stress is getting to them. To drink, so... Nice detail in the shadows, by the way. The good news is, I'm so exhausted I could sleep through a stampede of wild boars. 
which you'll be delighted to know is only slightly louder than your snoring. <laughs> I'm looking forward to rehearsing the act with you all night. So diligent of you to go over it and over it in your sleep. Practice makes perfect. Not today, it didn't. Well, I'm sorry you're so miserable. Really? Because if you wanted to make things more comfortable, you could always bear down a bit. Well, since you're so concerned about space, you can have it all. I'll sleep under the stars where at least the wild animals will be quieter than you. Jeez. I do not mean to interrupt, but it seems there is trouble on the road to friendship. <laughs> you think? Oh. Where's my wagon? What? I traded it to that pony from Saddle Arabia for his. He even threw in a pair of robes. Oh. And you what? you didn't wait I to ask the Trixie old, for worn out wagon that was too small for us for this nice new spacious one that we can both enjoy. <laughs> Who said you could do that? No pony, I just did it. Oh. <sighs> now we both have plenty of room. Ah, uh, Star Life. Have to give anything just away. doing things. Oh, contraire! I did give something away. I gave away my wagon and my best friend. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were better friends with that beat-up old wagon than you are with me. Well, it's easy when the wagon is a better friend. It would have never traded you away. That's ridiculous. Oh, it is ridiculous. In fact, this whole tour is ridiculous. I don't even know why I invited you in the first place. Well, maybe I should just head home. Oh, dear. I think that's a very good idea. And you can take this horrible giant caravan with you. Fine. Good. I cannot wait to find out who this guy is. Goodness, for oh, Miss Powerful. Yeah, but where is your assistant? I had hoped providing you with a more comfortable means of conveyance would allow you to once more dazzle the crowds with mystifying feats of magic. Normally, that sort of flattery would suffice. But today, we must discuss your dishonest and unfair procurement of my wagon. I desired your wagon and provided one of equal or better value in return. It seems like a perfectly honest and fair trade to me. Unfortunately, it is more nuanced than that. I'm sure it is, but I am eager to set out, if you'll excuse me. I am willing to wait as long as you are. I am <laughs> intrigued by this guy. I am so intrigued by this guy. You know, even if I was willing to reverse the trade, you don't have my caravan to offer in return. Oh, details! And now it's too heavy to fall through. You all seem a lot less threatening when there were two of us. She's really taking the whole thing back. This place is awful. How did I not see it before? You were blinded by the sound of music. Hey, tourists. I like how the songs have become like a part of the world. It's not its own separate thing. Yeah, sometimes traveling together is hard. You reminded us you can also make it fun. Thanks again. Steaming hot beverage. Thank you. No. What are you two doing? Taking a stand by lying down. Not that you care, wagon trader aware. 
I'm afraid I'm still not interested, despite your assistant's convenient appearance. Trixie, I came back to apologize. I should never have traded away the wagon. It wasn't mine to trade. It belongs to my friend. Hmm. If you truly were friends, I suppose I'd be honor bound to reverse the trade. Okay, fine. We're friends. Best friends who share a deep bond but weren't prepared for the emotional challenges. <laughs> God damn it, Trixie. Happy? I'm still unconvinced. Perhaps you could prove your friendship. How? Oh, we could do our friendship chant. You have a friendship chant. All right. Oh, dear, this is going our to be painful. I can imagine. I can already feel it coming. That we do all the time because we're such great friends. Magic. Oh God. Magic. Puff of smoke. One way. Oh, this is. <laughs> this is ter This is painful to watch. Sorry. Yeah, I would run away as well. <laughs> that was the worst friendship chant yes. I've ever heard. And you two were clearly making it up as you went. But only true friends would be willing to act so ridiculous for one another. So you'll get back the wagon? Though I'd suggest heading back to Ponyville. I'm not sure Saddle Arabia is ready for this. <laughs> That's fair. Huh. Who was that I'm guy? I'm sorry your Saddle Arabian tour was ruined. Honestly, I don't think I could have stood one more second on the road. At a certain point, I don't even like traveling with myself. <laughs> it is a lot harder than I thought. Still, I'm glad we tried. Mostly yeah. so we know not to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you have to try and fail before learning and something. More powerful than ever. Um. You know, there's actually plenty of room in here for one pony nap. Is the show over? You never... Oh, God. Ah. <laughs> Alrighty, then. So that was the road to friendship, and it was alright. Uh, a lot of fun in some places, and very kind of, like, predictable and kind of dragging in others. Kind of an even episode. I really love the song. I'm definitely going to look that up again. Um, but otherwise, it's an okay episode, I think. Uh, not as fun, in my opinion, as some of the others I've seen. But that's just my opinion. Uh, so, anyways, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you, uh, please tell me in the comments below what you thought about this episode, my reaction, and my entire channel in general. Please tell me both positive and negative. So I can use it all to grow and evolve to a better entertainer for you guys. But as always, my dear friends, thank you all so very much for watching. My name is Tony Fireflame, and I'll see you guys next time.